Hey everyone, today let's talk about a new JavaScript framework you're going to want to know about. Huno means flame in Japanese and it lives up to the name. It's a fast 14 kilobyte framework that runs everywhere and has a great developer experience. I'm Carl and I'll walk you through building an API for it. Let's get going. First, let's generate a fresh project using the official API. We'll pick the Node.js template and that's when the Cloud Run expects. So I'm going to walk through the options here and generate the project this will just take a moment and now we're going to be in a brand new folder with typescript setup we've got a ready to run index.ts and a dev script that runs npx for hot reloading let's look in more depth at that so we're going to import the hono library we've also got an adapter for node.js here what we see is we've initialized the app. We have an initial route here. Here we're serving on default port 3000. Now let's look at actually building an API. So we've enhanced the skeleton that was created with a couple new things. Number one, we've added Firestore. So Firestore is a serverless database that allow you to store records in it. Here we initialize the Firestore uh, SDK or rather the client. And here we have a couple routes. So I have a cars API and I'm getting records. Let's look at a couple neat things here. We're pulling from Firestore, we are returning records, and then we're sorting them by the most new records. And then we have a post uh, as well. Now let's check out cloud deployment. So here we're in cloud run. We are going to deploy the cars API. Let's take a couple look at the options. We're going to scroll up past some of the logs. Notice I don't need a Docker file. I point to the current directory. The build pack's going to recognize that I'm working with package.json and Node.js. Let's take a look at serving the API. Here we have the root URL. Let's also add an API cars to the end. This will list our cars and that's it. If you like this walkthrough, hit like and subscribe for more. See you next time.